Hey, this is Walt Matt, and I'm here with Fred Alexander, the Midwest premier ice fishing guide up in the Green Bay area. We're after trophy walleyes today, and we should have a good day. Well, we're hooked up here with a big fish, and uh, we just started, just dropped the lines down. Um, we got some new product that we're testing out today, and it looks like it works, eh, Kyle? Yeah, it smoked it, came for Oh, yeah, nice, nice big walleye, nice big walleye. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. Oh, 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 oh. Man, they like those new jigs. <laughs> oh, man. I'd say that's a female, huh? That's a big female. <laughs> Look oh, that's that. a nice one. Look at that sucker. Tell me about these new jigs now. I, well, I well these are the, this is the RPM, and uh, this is the uh, this is a size that we came out in 2015, and now our 2016-17 size is actually a little bit bigger. I started with that one, but proves that this one works. We've caught crappies on this, white bass, everything, and including big walleyes. But we've also got some new colors that are going to be out this year. But uh, definitely, definitely did the job. That's what it's all about. There's a whole bunch of hollering out of the shack. We had to cover. Oh, oh, big oh, look at that stuff. Oh, 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 look at that guy. Yeah, so <laughs> <laughs> look at that guy. Well, that's hey, a sweetheart. <laughs> that's awesome eating right there. Yeah. I'll take a bourbon any day. Right. So we got a, it's a nice size bourbon right here. They're just starting to roll in now, also with the walleye. So where the walleyes are, you're going to have the bourbon. And what people don't know about these bourbon, they're awesome eating. Um, they call it poor man's lobster. You boil it in 7-Up or diet 7-Up, dip it in butter, it's great. Now when working these RPMs, what I found is working the best here today is just a quick little hops and just a tiny little tickle in the pause, about a three to five second pause. <clears throat> these wallies up here in Door County, they always will hit on the pause, so you gotta make sure you pause it. And sometimes you can rip it high, but I've been noticing they're a little lethargic here today, so just a little hops, subtle hop, and then uh, sometimes a slow little tickle on the lift if you got a fish on you, that'll trigger a strike. That's what, that's what was working so far the best today. There's one, Brett. Oh, yeah, it feels like a really nice one. I'm going to get that cord out of your way Yeah, here, get that bud. cord out of the way there. Oh, we got one walleye, one bourbon, and let's see we'll what see this what is. We'll see what this one is. Yeah, I'm right behind the walleye, and I'm right behind the bourbon man, so we'll see what, <laughs> I'll see tell what we you. got. You see him? Oh, here. Oh, oh, oh nice one. Oh, yeah. All right. That's a dandy. Yeah, this is on the new RPM, and it's a little bit larger size than our than our, than our other, than our standard one that we came out with last year, and this is one of the new, uh, new blue glow colors. It's got a little glow in it, got a little blue in it, and uh, he smacked it. I'll tell you what, that's a pretty hot bait you got going yeah. there. Liking it. We got about another Thanks. 45 minutes of walleye fishing. We're going to head out white fishing. All right, thank you. Good job, man. Get another on one. the spot. Nice. Hey, let me show you some of the tackle and uh, gear that we're using here to catch these bigger walleyes out here in Sturgeon Bay. First off, you want a nice stout rod. Myself, personally, I like a 32-inch medium-heavy by Fraybill. It's nice because you can use it in the shack. It's not too long, but yet it's got a lot of, a lot of backbone for those fish. My favorite uh, lure out here right now is this golden-colored uh, RPM lure from Custom Jigs and Spins. I like to put a little minnow head on here, but there's a lot of other lures that guys are using that also work hard here, too. The main forage base out here is that these walleyes are feeding on is shiners or gobies. Although it's ultra clear water, if you're using a spoon, you want a spoon like the slender spoon that's got some gold back to it. And other bright colors, colors that are going to kind of match the hatch, perch patterns, darker kind of more natural patterns, stuff like that. I've got the new RPM over here, which is a little bit larger size than the regular. This one is going to really be a killer for walleye out this year. And then something a little bit different, we've got uh, Bee Fishing Tackle, which is also owned by Custom Jigs and Spins. We've got Bucktail Wayne's Bucktail Jigs. So you put a shiner on those, you jig them up and down, bounce them off the bottom, it'll trigger those walleyes to go sometimes too. So try some of this tackle and you'll do all right out here too. Nice, eater. nice little eater. Yeah, a little nice one. Man, but I'll take it. Yeah. yeah. 
came on that perch RPM. Were you working it pretty aggressively? Yeah, yeah, I came in, he was looking at it for a long time, and I was like, you know what, Brett told me to stick to it, and I just kind of stuck to the stuck to the rhythm I was doing, and bam. That's a good eater size yep. right there. All right. Awesome. Nice job. Hey, we had a great day on the ice. I'd like to thank Brett Alexander, along with Larry, Ben Royce, and the rest of the gang. We had we caught some walleyes, we had a burbot, Little of this, little of that, we caught yeah. some fish. It was a you know, like, good time. Like I said, the bites slow right now. They're just rolling in. It's going to get better and better. But you know what? We got her done, and we got a, we got a couple of really nice oh, fish. Oh, yeah, a couple and, nice uh, fish, yep. So next time you're up in this area, give Brett a call, pick up some RPMs, and we'll catch you next time. This is Walt Matten with Midwest Outdoors. We'll be right back.